Hey, guess what? Special Home Pro Hero Show here. Instead of being at my house, I'm at a home show with five multi-million dollar homes. If you're looking for ideas uh, for your home and you need good ones, these house shows, if there's any in your area, are phenomenal. Been going to these for years and uh, taking a ton of ideas from these places. You don't have to do it on their scale. You can do it on your scale, which is awesome. I'm with my wife and we'll take a look. First house, number one, I like it. I love the color, a lot of windows. Nice car in the driveway too. I love white brick, it's one of my favorite things. And I love those big wood accents. Obviously I'm not gonna put those on my home, but this house really pops from the outside. Oh, we're probably, I'm guessing three mil on this one. I love this patio. It's in the front landscape of the house. You don't see that very often. Man, that's real stone there. No joke. Some money. Windows are incredible. I love it. They are floor to ceiling. We'll probably every bit of 20 feet up. Overlooks the pool area. Pretty cool light picture. picture. The fan and a light. Can't even really tell, but it blows the air. You can feel it. Pretty cool. Yeah. Cable rare, rare. Made from steel. Oh, this looks like stamp. This looks like stamp concrete. Possibly, I don't know. Maybe tile. So downstairs basement bedroom, we're loving this black wall. And then I've got an idea here. The wife likes it, I do too. That's very uncommon. It's crazy, I think these doors are every bit of seven or eight foot, they gonna be eight foot doors. The whole entire house, it's crazy. Honestly, I wasn't that impressed with this one. Hope they get better, maybe this is the worst one. Don't get me wrong, it's a nice house, got a lot of nice finishes. It just uh, didn't do as much for me as other houses have in the past. We'll see what this next one's like. Ooh, I'm not in love with it. I like the uh, board and batten, that's cool. Let's see what it's got. Okay, now we're talking wainscoting, one of my favorites, although it's really sloppy. Uh, look at some of the detail, real sloppy. Uh, this morning, you can see the shine. They put way too shiny on the paint, which shows everything. Nice built in. I like the uh, wood color here with the painted cabinets. Pretty neat. Cool space. Uh, I love the staircase too. So you can see that walking in. Okay, here's a cool little thing in the basement. Uh, looks like fake brick, possibly. Yeah, maybe real brick. I don't know. I like the wood in front of it. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool room. The uh, roof's half moon. A lot of arches in this house. Double sided fireplace, too. It's a cool room. I'm not sure what you use it for other than maybe wine tastings, it looks like. Hidden door. Uh, yeah, a little hidden door. Utilities? Utilities, all the mechanics. Can you go and look real quick? Oh, please, go ahead, yeah. All right, you know I'm gonna do hidden door soon. So the utility room, that's kind of what I'm gonna do here. It's a hidden bookcase. Pretty neat. A bookcase, yeah, I think. Okay, so now we're talking my language. We're in the theater here. Pretty cool ceiling, I've seen that before. This, this theater beats my theater by a mile, I think. Um, another hidden door, it's kind of neat. Pretty cool bathroom. It's got a oh, nice shower set up there. Some money. Stuff's expensive. Okay, this house has some nice detail. I definitely like the uh, bench under the window. Uh, that's something I can do in my house, and definitely got that on the agenda. My wife's in love with closet chandeliers right now. I have to get one of those. Pretty cool that I think it's probably like four doors there that slide into the wall. 
I wanted to do it at my house, but the, the price is ridiculous. It's pretty cool. Built in. Uh, it's like one inch material. Boy, look at that. No. Pretty cool wood wall with some cool pictures. Sconces are cool too. Okay, that's a little unique. Nice built ins. Ooh, I like that. It's wood with a black hinge. Three quarter inch plywood. I'm going to copy this. I like the look of it. I did something similar in my home theater in my old house. Very similar. I like the black hardware with the stain. It looks really sharp. I don't quite understand that. Kind of a interesting lay here. Uh, so it's tile and it's wood grain. Looks kind of cool, herringbone like that. Then what I do hate is the penny tile. I got that idea from here a couple years ago. I paid the price. I'll tell you about that some other time. Okay, we're in an upstairs balcony. Got a couple eggs here. Pretty cool. We want to put eggs in our screen in porch. I think I can make that happen. But uh, pretty neat. And the wife said they're pretty comfortable. Two is definitely a better home than the first one. I believe it was the same builders. Stigma builders, never heard of them. Probably high end, that's why. Okay, house three, super contemporary. I used to love this house, but not so much now. Pretty cool entryway. Looks like 10 foot doors, and eh, nine foot. Let's take a look at it. Wow, the bottles are empty, that sucks. I've seen that rack on the internet, they're expensive as heck. That's kind of crazy, man. It's like corner slider opening window patio door. No snap very often. Hmm. Kind of a cool mantle. Put that thing out of. Sounds like steel. Yeah, nothing too special out here. They do have the screens that pull down and lift up. That's kind of neat. Windows. You're going to have a window soon too, babe. A little too contemporary for me. So these basement ceilings are probably every bit of, uh, I'm guessing 10, uh, they're bigger than 10, I'm guessing 12 feet, maybe 11 feet, I don't know. I think 12 with the uh, price of lumber, I don't know, it's only price is an option. option. Oh, cool with the stone around the theater. Hello, golf simulator. I'm talking about. You know, I can't play golf. I could if I could have that. Okay, it's all right. Uh, uh, maybe better than the first one. What do you think? Which one do you like the best so far? I don't know, one or two, not this one. One or two? Yeah. yeah this one uh, a little too contemporary. It kind of carried throughout. Had a kind of a cool basement area, but yeah, like I said, uh, 18 years ago, it might have been my flavor, but. Uh, Right now, I'm more of craftsman farmhouse like. Guess that comes with age. All right, let's check out house four. Both me and the wife agree that the outside looks pretty cool. A lot of different finishes. You got lap siding, white brick. I love that. I like the cedar tone shutters. I need to put some of those on my house, and I like those right there. So I'm definitely going to steal that idea. I got to get a close up of that. Uh, it looks like brown windows, though. Then it has stone too, so it's got like four different outside sidings. Okay, I'm gonna steal this idea. I've seen it before on House and Pinterest, but I might have to do this in the master bedroom. Some thick, looks like fake beams coming down. Give me some drywall work there. And then they just put shiplap pieces in between and caulked it. Looks sharp. We could do that in our bedroom, it'd be really cool. Love that one. Okay, this one's got a really cool outdoor living space. I'm not quite sure what that's called. I've seen it before. Um, not sure how practical that outside living space is. Check out this up here. 
I love that roof. It almost feels like a pavilion. And I definitely like the transoms above the windows or above the doors. They're like a, it's like a browns color. It's not a black. It's like almost a brown color window. Oh, this room looks cool. Okay, super cool room. Probably my favorite room so far. I love it. Everything about it, I love this room. I just don't know if I can steal any ideas from it because I don't have space I could use this. Really cool with the windows. Awesome room. I forgot I wanted to show this. So same roof in the great room. I'm copying that. Well, I tell you one thing, uh, my wife likes this room obviously. But uh, with the bourbon setting upstairs and this downstairs, it's everything my wife and I need. Pretty cool. I like the uh, gold. Cool with the stone back. That's great. Wine cooler, nothing mean cool. And surrounded by windows. Big grass. A little low ceilings there. Kind of cool, cool air patio area. Sunk down in. Stamped concrete. I don't know that because I see the cut lines. I like these doors. So does this floor look familiar? Same floor I put mine. My house didn't cost a million plus. It's pretty weird right here. I saw this. They have uh, two windows here and they cut the shelf around it. It's really sloppy back there too. And this is fake wood here. Kind of a shocker. Yeah, you can't have fake wood in the middle of that home. Not too impressed with the laundry rooms. I think I got a leg up in this apartment. Check out this home. Super contemporary, somewhat. Almost like a French design or something. Let's take a, take a look at house five. Okay, from the outside, this one looks like it's going to be something special here. <laughs> the uh, black's a hit. Seems like every house around here has black and white. All right, just got told there's a bourbon room back here. Okay, that's cool. Super cool. I like this design. Huh, simple. Pretty cool doors. I bet they're expensive. And like mine, walk-in shower, seamless, no threshold. That's what I'm talking about. Every one of these houses should have that. It's not that hard to do. Big tub, small window. Yeah. I got a vinyl pool. Come on, give me a good basement. I haven't really seen one other than that. Maybe a golf simulator. Okay, it's pretty cool. Once again, I'm not sure if you can see it on the camera, but you see the streaks? It's because they went with a shiny paint. Gotta go flat. You gotta do that kind of stuff. I didn't think those kind of walls are even in anymore, but this one doesn't look too bad. It's black. I feel like I'm in Malibu. Pretty cool shingles. And uh, yeah, I definitely feel like Malibu now, especially with the shutters. Pretty cool. Obviously, they're just for show, but aluminum. Okay, what'd you think? I like of this house one. number five. I didn't really like that one too much. I was in a couple of rooms. Look at that monster. Thing is a hotel. It's crazy. Okay, we're at the final house, house six. None of these have awards in front, so they must not have done that this year, but look at this puppy. I love the way it looks. Probably aesthetically, it's probably my favorite, mainly because that board and batten look. And then you throw in some white brick with some black and gray. Ooh, like it. I think every one of these homes are black and gray, it seems. 
All right, once again, we're going all dark in this thing. You can only get away with this because of the windows. But once again, man, the, the shiny paint kills this room. I can't stand that. But pretty cool. I like that. I like the point. You're gonna have one too soon. Yeah, we can do some more here. Tell you one thing, it's hot in here. All right, here's another one of those lights with the fan in it. Well, must be kicking it up. I don't feel it down here at all. Pretty cool. Makes a lot of noise. It's pretty loud though. Okay, cool space. Uh, let's see if it's got screens up there. Nope. Uh, so I have a feeling bugs. I guess you're, yeah, you got a light little pond over there. Um. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of a cool house, but I'm not sure how much, it seems like a cheap house to me, I don't know. Cheaper, I guess I'd say. <laughs> Even the outside's not that great. It's cool though. Let's see what the basement has to offer. It's gotta be good, this is a ranch. Oh, not a big fan of all this wood. Ooh, a little too much wood. I feel like I'm in a western. Looks like a uh, poplar, birch. It looks like birch. A lot of wood. And by the way, all these homes had finished smooth ceilings. More expensive, obviously. Only a three-bedroom ranch. Unless we missed a bedroom. I don't think he's getting my vote. Just saying. I mean, it's nice, but uh, the finishes are off a little bit. They're not as nice. You know, if you're looking for ideas, home improvement ideas, these home shows are great. I mean, usually I look at Pinterest and house, but it's nice to get inside these homes and kind of feel them out. Look forward to this every year. We've been to these a thousand times, it seems. And every year they seem to get better and better. Then disappoint, definitely some nice homes. But uh, well worth it, got some great ideas. Now I just gotta get home and do it.